Hi, it's James Mitchell. Here's another video on workshop software. I really hope you get some great value from it and you enjoy it. All the best. Hi, welcome to this overview of a brand new feature that we've added into workshop software. This one is around auto creating a stock order for a supplier. So let's go take a look. If we go into the plus and we're going to create a supplier stock order, I'm going to go off and find a supplier, so ABC Parts Store. There's this new star here, which is our actions. And you'll see here that there is this auto create function. So with auto create, what we can do is we can now choose a few different things. So we can choose which way do we want to output the stock order? Do we want to do it by brand, by description, group, item, location, or supplier? So for example, if I wanted to do it by item code, I could set a range of item codes, for example, so zero to ZZ, in other words, all of them. Or if I just wanted to do it by one particular item code or range of items, or maybe a range of groups or a particular supplier, whatever, or range of suppliers, I could do that. So in this instance, I'm gonna do it by basically all item, item codes, just as an example. So if I go confirm, what this does is this has gone and added these products onto this stock order, right? So it's gone and said I need five of these and six of these, 11 of these, six of these, right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just save this stock order for a second and I'm gonna go in and have a look at the A360. Let's just go and find our A360 and I'll show you the details on this. So what this has got, this has a minimum of two and a maximum of five. So um, in each product, what we can do now is set the minimums and maximums. And based upon those minimums and maximums will mean what the stock order does. So in this instance, if I go back to that stock order that we just had open, it's ordering five. And the reason is, is because the maximum is five, it was below the minimum. So you can, if you wanted to, if you wanted to make that four or something like that, or make it more or less or whatever, you can certainly do that. That's that's no no problem at all. So um, you can edit them, you could delete them if you didn't want them, that sort of stuff. So there you have it. It's a super simple and uh, easy to use function, but this provides you really great power in terms of your stock reordering and how you can effectively manage your stock. Again, hope you find this great new tool valuable and that it really does help your business.